255 students from combat engineering level and explosive ordnance devices have completed their training at the School of Combat Engineers, Karama, in Mubende District. The Joint Staff, Chief Engineering, Brigadier General Besji Benkunda, who was the chief guest urged the graduates to maintain the discipline they exhibited during the training whenever they are deployed to live longer. It is important to train, but it is also crucial to apply those skills. So we expect you the, the, the way you have demonstrated in the exercises there. We hope that you will perform even much better. Most often, uh, students have high discipline in training schools, but when they get out there, they run astray. Please, for you as an individual, you have to maintain discipline. I can assure you, uh, maintain discipline, you will, first of all, live longer, because if you go to, 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 to those bars and related activities that are there, you know what, what will end up with you. you the little money you, you, you earn, you will drink, you will spend it in the bars. The commandant of the School of Combat Engineers, Colonel Wilson Cabrera, thanked the Minister of Defense and the UPDF strategic leadership for supporting the school, which has gone from one block building to a bombing school. The UPDF capability, troop readiness, and discipline are enshrined in its training values and in our capacity to adapt and counter enemy threats. This is reflected in our vision as a school, which is to train and produce officers and men who will provide solutions to the commander's decision in the field. So the trainees before you have been taken through a comprehensive training in core aspects of combat engineering as follows. Organization, rigging, demolition, water supply, mine warfare, bobby traps, rods, roughs, water mineship, urban mobility bridging, EOD stroke demining, bridging, utilities, political education, and financial resilience. Explosive theory, EOD tasks management, modern mines, use of explosives, skills at arm, submunitions, search, tactical casualty combat care, guided weapons. As a training school, our objectives have been met, and we believe those Course content includes explosive theory, task management, modern mines, use of explosives, skills at arms, political education, drill, financial resilience, and military law, among others. Haruna Mtesa Sira, UBC News.